Talking with David Niven, Joan Hackett, Billy Eckstein, and, and with John Marley. Um, anyone, anyone have a shark story? That, that, that's just terrifying. I don't have a shark story, but I have a story uh, very similar to David. Uh, I did America, America in uh, Greece, mm -hmm. and Ilya Kazan is, uh, was directing the picture, and he has a reputation for uh, not being too peaceful in his approach to actors or acting or stunts. And at one time, they're supposed to throw my body over a cliff. It's a 40-foot drop into, into the ocean. And he actually had the nerve to ask me to do it. Hey. How many feet? 40 feet. 40 feet. You know, that's, I mean, it's a, it's a precipitous drop. Yes. And I said, Gadge, I can't do that. He says, you're chicken. You know, and I said, yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> so we had but, to try a new method. <laughs> so they got, they got the, uh, one of the, uh, the guys in the wardrobe department, and he, he put... Uh, you know, they patted him and everything, and he did the jump and cracked three ribs. Okay. And, and the, 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 point, the whole point of the story was is that it was a long shot. You wouldn't know who the hell jumped up the cliff. It didn't and, even need to be a man. Gadge insisted, you know, tried to insist that I would do the stunt. Does something come over directors, seriously? You hear many stories of, of directors putting people in jeopardy. There, there uh, are many directors yeah, like is that. Is there a mentality that uh, takes over when you're a director, that the movie yeah. is all important and you, we can expend... Uh, they, talk, they want realism, you know. And, mm -hmm. and the realism doesn't even show when they do it. Creation, do you know what I mean? You act as a tools at that time. It's on film anyway. And, and the necessity is to make a great film, isn't it? And, and anything else I, mean, is I, don't, I don't think John Frankenheimer would, would try to do you in if he were sitting here, but when making no, a film, maybe it just, you become obsessed with that and forget. Well, how, how many people have been killed in the history of movie making, really? Uh, oh, not very many. No. Oh, but no. it's always you hear rumors you hear that, uh, no, really whenever a big picture comes out, there are always these rumors that they uh, ran over three men with the army truck, but, it, but they quieted it down. And, uh, or it the has big, uh, I mean, it's usually the stuntmen, though, I must it's say. It's much, yes. much of a minimum occurrence, though. Yeah. I, oh, yeah. Not, very, not, not often at all. More in the old days, I think. Some of those old, even the silent epics, they took terrible chances with yeah. people. They, they sank boats without finding out if all the extras could swim and things. It's well, really yeah. appalling. <laughs> they, they didn't have a union yet. That's right, there was no there union, was no union in, uh, at that time. Yeah. Oh, Does anyone know Catherine Hepburn? What, do you know, David? Excuse me, I just, I just wanted to, before I forget this, do you, know, do you know Catherine Hepburn very well, David? Yes. yes. Do you know, is it true in, in summertime, there's a point where she's taking a picture, I believe, for a tour or something, and she falls backwards into a canal in Venice. And I've never been to Venice, but people tell me that the canals contain all of the last things you Just would want to oh, fall into. Yeah. Did, did she? Oh, yes, yeah, she, she did. I wasn't there. Well, certainly that she did, yes. Yeah. Yes. That's, That's a sewer. Oh, a sewer, yeah. See, I've always so. asked to do my own stunts and, and had them protect me it, it's with such passion that I, I'm always disappointed that I can't do it. But also, it's a very silly thing to do because you do it... Yes, a, it is. A, you know, you, you, stupid if you get hurt, that. you ruin the picture because you have to go to hospital. Yeah. And you're doing a good stuntman out of a job. I always thought it was idiotic. Aside from the pain you're enduring. The pain, yes. <laughs> I have been chastened yeah. by other actors who said, don't dare do that, don't ever do that again. But burning up in a film that will come out shortly, I really wanted to have the fire on me, and they had a stunt girl do it, and I didn't think she died like I would have chosen to die. So you don't feel like you it's don't your get to die too frequently, you know, yeah. and on film that is. Hmm. Yeah. But I wonder if uh, and it seems silly that they would let an actor do anything dangerous unless it's the last shot in the movie. And I, I've heard <laughs> them say, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, uh, "We are near the end." Yeah. <laughs> I've got a couple of friends in Los Angeles that I played golf with. They were stunt men. And they're constantly, I mean, a guy who's supposed to play, we know he can't play, he's broken his hand or his finger or something like that. And these are the guys that do it for a living that really mm -hmm. know how to take the falls and things. So I imagine it would be kind of rough for a legitimate actor to... I, I know the stuntmen do get hurt. How about Bobby? I know you know Bob Morgan. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Who was, uh, what's his name's husband? Um, you know, that played on the monster. Uh, he wanted to Monica call Oh, well, I, well maybe. Made, oh, yes, but he was completely on that, how the West was one, wasn't that the one? He, he was on the stunt in there between the planes and the uh, between trains, and it completely cut his leg, one leg off, and his, he's all. He lost a leg in oh, the yes. making it? Oh, he was all, he's all patched together. Jeez. He's all patched together. I never together. my services for stunts. Especially when they're taking, <laughs> taking away... I'm glad I'm a saloon singer. It. There's not too much trouble in there. Also, stunt women, forgive me, don't really get a great deal of uh, credit, and they are rodeo people and, and uh, 
really surprising. We forget of course, there are stunt women. Yeah. Yes. I always thought that they put a wig on men. In some cases, they will, but, but there are stunt women. But he walked one like show. this. I kept asking him to kind of get it, but he, he kept support your local sheriff, and he hated it. He was playing he was you? The, but yes, he, he was terribly yeah. funny. You know who I want to meet is Yakima Kanat. He's one of my great oh. heroes. He's a, the, cla the great, the stuntman of stuntmen, and he now directs what they call second unit work. Uh, he directed um, the Ben-Hur chariot had scene. Had and all. Too, he was Did he work on that? Fantastic. And the John Ford films? <coughs> he, he worked Age coach. He yeah. did the great fall from the coach, hey. jumping up four horses and then falling off the lead two, and the whole lot, eight horses, and the coach went over him. He's lying on his back. Do you remember that great That's stunt? right. They get, yeah. he, he falls off the, between the lead yeah, team between and Between the two lead horses, and uh -huh. eight horses, and the coach go over the top of him. Yeah. And he's right in the middle. He never got scratched. Yeah. But he used to prepare it like mad, you know. He'd tell me. He used to take terrific preparation. Well, how do you prepare a thing like that? Because you can't rehearse it, can you? You only do it once. Or did he rehearse no, it at slow he, speed? I, I think he did rehearse the actual... Lay it out. Yes, yeah. he laid yeah, it out. Yeah, and yeah. Yeah. He took, they do anyway, it. took the minimum risk, he always said. But, uh, God, not for me. Well, they might do the stunt once, but they rehearse all the elements involved and then, yeah. and then coordinate the whole thing. And if you want to do your own stunt, they really help you. And they, they and they Yes, and they do <laughs> lot. I mean, they, they tell you all of their tricks. Depending on how popular you are at the time. Yeah. There is a quote attributed to you. Might I ask, do I have time, yeah. that Mr. Nevin want, said that he didn't want to... Um, about the theater. He said, no, 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 I want to go to the theater Saturday night, not play in the theater Saturday night. Is that a truth? Oh, I hate playing in the theater. Yes, I love it. I did yeah. want to know. I love to sit in the theater and watch people <laughs> acting their guts out, but my idea of hell is, is to, to go to work when everybody else is going home to dinner. <laughs> 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 you have worked in the theater. Oh, yeah, I oh, hate yeah. it. I do. I, I did you, I, did you think, think of getting a stat man if you ever act with Gloria Swanson <laughs> again? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> The last time oh, you were here, you told, about, you yeah, told a story about never, her. Never again. She got too angry. Her dress <laughs> falling apart. When she was here, she said you were a naughty boy. Yeah. But it was some time ago. <laughs> 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 I thought you were naughty. <laughs> we have to uh, go away for a minute, and we'll be right back.